Hello everyone, welcome to Informatica support videos. In this video, we will understand how to use the fixed width file formats in cloud data integration. The product here is in Informatica Intelligent Cloud Services, cloud data integration. The presenter is Ramanuja from Informatica Global Customer Support. Let us have a use case where the source flat file does not have a delimiter but has a fixed file width which is separated by a spacebar. We are going to understand how to set up the fixed width component and how to use it in source while writing it to a simple flat file target demo. Let us have a look at the source file. So this is the source file we are talking about. The employee ID, name, city and state where the employee ID has two space bars and the name has sufficient amount of space before the next column. So this is how the table has been configured. It is the source file. So, uh, let us go to an ICS. So if we go to components, if we choose fixed width file formats to rename it to rm new file demo we have to choose the flat file connection that has the object to select the object that is in question here Once we have the values, we have to place the first uh, limit at zero. Once we add it, we have to drag the second before the next column starts. Add another before the third column starts. Add one more before the fourth column starts. And one where the fourth column ends. And you can rename the fields from column zero, one, two, three, and save it save the fixed width file format let us create a simple mapping source we are going to select the same object And under formatting options, we are going to use fixed width as flat file type and use the one that just we just created. Okay. And under fields, if we see, we can see the four columns and in the target. I'm going to choose the same flat file connection, but we are just going to create new at runtime fix it output dot txt save we are going to save the mapping. It is valid. We are going to run it. The same agent which I am using. Let us see how it goes. Okay, let us go to our target file directory. 
this is the output we see the target is not uh, having the format uh, in the way we have configured the reason is we did not choose the target uh, if we use the fixed file format as the same which we created and save the mapping and run yeah uh, after changing the fixed file format let us have a look at the updated output we have the same way the source has been configured to summarize our discussion we understood how to use fixed file format in a simple source file or uh, use it as a target with the formatting options as fixed width we would love to hear back from you at support videos at the rate informatica.com or you can follow us on twitter with infa support thank you